The right honourable gentleman knows very well that we had no choice but to close the school. <laughs> Teachers cannot teach when there is no heating, no lighting in their classrooms. And I ask the right honourable gentleman, whose fault is that? No, no, that's no. Methinks the right honourable lady doth screech too much. <laughs> And, and, and if she wants us to take her seriously, she must learn to calm down. <laughs> if the right honourable gentleman could perhaps attend more closely to what I am saying, rather than how I am saying it, he may receive a valuable education in spite of himself. <laughs>